Henry Cavill and his girlfriend Natalie Viscuso are making their red carpet debut as a couple. The pair stepped out for their first public appearance together in New York City at the premiere for the 39-year-old actor's film Enola Holmes 2. Henry smiled affectionately as he gazed at his lady love while posing for pictures. On Thursday, Natalie complimented her beau's pinstripe suit, wearing a cream off the shoulder dress with a black belt. Their outing comes a year and a half after the couple revealed they were dating in April 2021. At the time, Henry shared an adorable photo of himself playing chess with a TV executive on Instagram to make things official. Another bond he shares is the one he has with his co-star Millie Bobby Brown. He opened up to Access Hollywood about their sibling-like relationship at the event. It's a lot of fun working with Millie. Millie is absolutely fantastic, huge bombastic energy, and a very keen mind. She's a fantastic producer and a wonderful actress. You guys are great together. The banter, it's so good. Um, do you have that brother-sister sort of bond relationship on set too? We do, very much so. Lots of teasing going on, lots of jokes. Uh, she doesn't try to get me to do TikTok videos anymore, thank goodness. <laughs> but uh, we do make fun of each other a lot. Yeah. Okay, I gotta ask, you're still in the running for 007. Would you do it if you were offered? I think it's it, there's a time issue, and it's not necessarily just about the offer. Um, it's about script, it's about director, it's about where they want to take the story. And Barbara and Mike are fantastic producers and I have absolute faith in them, but it's, it's always more than just an offer. Absolutely, and I gotta give you a congratulations. Black Adam, you made your cameo, it hit 140 million at the box office worldwide. What did it mean to have The Rock fight for you to come back? You know what, this whole thing has been a, a very long journey. And all of Seven Bucks, uh, including Dwayne as well, have have been uh, they've been on a mission for a while, and it's it's just a privilege to be back in the Cape, and I'm very thankful to all of them, and to everyone else who is in the decision-making process.